Francis Contreras, and I'm really happy to have you guys here. I'm going to be your teacher for the fifth grade uh, for the following year. And today I wanted to start by um, showing you guys my rules for class and my expectations. My rules are one, follow directions, have a hungry mind, and be respectful. What do I mean by follow directions? It doesn't mean here only, they, it doesn't pertain only to the classroom. I want you guys to follow directions every, everywhere you go here in school. Have a hungry mind means be ready to learn. You guys are here to learn. I'm here to deliver the learning strategies I have for you guys, and I expect you guys to learn, so be ready. Be respectful, that means be respectful to your classmates, be respectful to me and any other teacher, everybody in campus. Make sure you guys are respectful, because I do not put up with that. There's consequences to everything we do here in my classroom, as it is in life. So here are the procedures I'm gonna have for you guys. My, the first one would be a verbal warning, one-to-one -one conference teacher and student where teacher will attempt to find out what the reason for the misbehavior is. So that would be, I would pull you guys out of class, have a little conference with you guys, ask what's going on, why is it that you guys are misbehaving, and try to adjust that. The second would be a verbal warning, one-to-one -one conference teacher and student again, ask why the misbehavior is continuing, and make an agreement to establish, uh, establish next steps consequences if misbehavior continues. That means I'm gonna have a contract for you guys on the second time, have you guys signed it. Uh, we will find out what the problem is and how you guys or I can help you guys behave. And if that doesn't happen, then I have a third verbal warning conference with student, parent, teacher, Make parents aware of the problem, show them the paperwork, I have proof that I met with you guys and that you decided to behave and you signed the paper but that you're not following. And with your parents, I will establish um, another contract where I will have procedures on how to help you. I will help you, your parents will help you, and if that doesn't happen then dot down what the consequence would be so that on the first time, if it comes to that, I will send you guys to the office with a referral, involve your parents, and follow steps that we pro uh, previously established with your parents. They are pretty basic consequences or procedures, and my rules are pretty basic, so I do expect all of you guys to follow them. I wanna have a good school year, so please make sure that if you guys have any questions, I am gonna pass around a sheet and you guys are going to sign on it <clears throat> and what that means is that you guys understood them so if you guys have any questions please let me know before you sign